Hi guys, welcome back. And today, uh, John, myself and John, we're going to do, give you a little bit of a, a continuous Kumite drill. And what I'm going to do with uh, John here is I'm just going to turn him into a little bit of a zombie. I'm just going to turn his arms out like this. All right, now, uh, John can move around as you probably would in a Kumite using your whole entire ring. And I'm also going to be aware that this is, these are how long his arms are, and this is where his reach lies. So I don't want to be anywhere near these really, alright? So I can, John, if you just want to move around very slowly for me, I can follow him around, and I can stay in front of him for this scoring zone here, which is obviously the torso, and obviously for up to the head. Because uh, most, of our, most of our techniques are straight, there's three techniques, mainly are straight, and obviously we have the round kick and the hook kick which come around from the side. So, whilst John is moving around, I can also be aware that this is where his reach lies, not including his legs. I've got John moving around and I can come in, <coughs> stay away from his arms, <coughs> and come around the sides. All right. Also, when John is turning, I can actually use my hands as a block, as blocks, and come underneath to create a scoring opportunity at the side or round the back using the straight or round techniques. Okay, so if we were to do this maybe for a duration of two to three minutes, if you're working on your endurance and your fitness, if you're sparring, obviously because you'd be nice and light on your feet, doing nice fast. Just move around from the door. Nice fast techniques like so. And obviously you are always conscious about where these arms lie. You are reacting to where your partner is moving which is very, very similar to what it would happen in a real Kimite situation. And you are practicing the individual, both straight and round techniques that you can use and should use when you're doing continuous sparring. So practice that with your partner. All right, that's a very, very easy one. Not much chance for injury, All right, but uh, it's very, very good for your endurance and making sure that you practice your continuous flowing techniques. Have a go. See you next time. Thanks for watching.